Jeremy will always be a part of uh, NCAA athletic history. You know, that's something that nobody can ever take away from him, and that they'll, you know, he'll be able to tell his kids and his grandkids, and uh, uh, if he lives long enough, his great grandkids. <laughs> I had I had no idea we'd thrown the ball that many times. It didn't seem like it in the game until afterwards. My arm felt like it was going to fall off. It was bittersweet because we did lose, and um, you know, I'd much rather take a win than a record. But uh, I mean, it's a it's a cool feeling to know that no one else has done that before. Uh, the two records that Moses broke specifically, he set an NCAA individual record for pass attempts and pass completions uh, completions against Sam Houston State. And then there was a team record that was broken as well, and we set an NCAA Division I record for total plays run in the game. The total play uh, record was a game between Montana and Montana State. Uh, the two individual records were held by former Purdue quarterback uh, Drew Brees, who's now in the NFL. There were a lot more records in, in that uh, game that were broken, school records. Just an incredible day, and it's, it's something that's unique because uh, for the fans that are in the stands, someday they can look back and they see, you know, I was a part of that. I mean, we get to be in the record books for something that nobody else has done ever. It's a pretty cool feeling. But he achieved something that, uh, you know, in the many years of, of athletic competition that nobody up until this point has done. So it's just, it's special. And from a media relations standpoint, it's a lot of fun for me to be able to, you know, to write about it and, and let people know about it.